All right, welcome back to the channel. So here is equipment number two. This is a brand new Kubota SVL 97-2. Is a compact track loader. And uh, this will be my main piece of equipment for my land carrying and uh, brush cutting business. Uh, bought it from State Equipment in Cross Lanes, West Virginia. And it's a pretty heavy duty piece of equipment. One thing I had them do different than what I, uh, than what comes from the factory is I had them attach the, the rear view camera to the, the rear bonnet here, rather than up on the back of the cab. Uh, because as you'd see, when you look through it, all you'd see is that orange bar and not much of the, the ground below you. So I asked them to do that and they made that happen, which I was very happy about. Like I said, this is brand new. I think I've got about six hours on it. It, it didn't stay clean very long, especially with this uh, this muddy weather that we've had. Uh, I also purchased a couple of uh, attachments. As you can see right here, a Blue Diamond uh, grapple. Pick that up, as well as a Blue Diamond Severe Duty Series 2 brush cutter. Now, this is uh, not the one that I will be keeping. Uh, this was actually this was actually not supposed to be sent to me. This was, uh, I believe, intended to go to. Uh, I'm not sure exactly what happened, but they sent me the wrong unit. And uh, as you can see, it's got some scuffs and damage to it. But uh, uh, they sent me this machine in error. And Blue Diamond, uh, you know, a judge of a of a company is, you know, in my opinion, is their customer service. And I got to say. You know, everyone makes mistakes, but it's how you handle it that uh, that that really determines uh, your worth as a business. And uh, Blue Diamond definitely uh, has indicated that they're going to come through. Um, they're going to be sending out a brand new unit, and they'll be picking this one up uh, uh, as soon as the other one comes in. So I'll be able to do a much better review on this beast. So looking forward to getting it out into the field. But uh, very nice track loader. I did add, uh, eh, it's kind of ugly, but I wanted to have something to protect the seat. So in case you get in, you got a, you know, a pin or a screwdriver in your pocket and poke any holes into the, into the vinyl. So uh, I didn't get, uh, the air ride seats just has the standard, uh, spring seats. It did come with the, with a radio. Oh, also, uh, it does have the high flow, uh, the high flow, uh, hydraulics on it this is a Kubota factory uh, cover so I had the dealer put that on it so to protect it if I get into any heavy brush keep it from knocking out any of the lines or anything like that I do need to add a protector something to keep these as you can see the tracks have already been kind of scraping against uh, that protective sheathing so anyway uh like I said, I, I'd show you when uh, when my new equipment came in. Uh, I will be adding some additional accessories, some uh, some additional lighting. Uh, probably will not go with the Kubota LED lighting as it's very expensive. I'll probably just get some Amazon LED lights and put it on. But uh, here it is. If you have any questions, uh, please put them in the comment. Uh, and again, uh, please like and subscribe. I certainly appreciate it. Uh, I'm really looking forward to getting this new business off of the ground. And if you're in the uh, mid-Ohio Valley part of West Virginia and you're interested in having uh, some uh, land cleared, brush cut, uh, debris removal, you know, please reach out to me. All right. Have a great day. Bye-bye.